Hi everyone, welcome to Mel and Shannon's World of Bookish Adventures, aka The Book Chronicles. <laughs> I'm Melanie. I'm Shannon. <laughs> and we're going to take you on our bookish vlog. We wanted to go to a quiet Starbucks today <laughs> and have some coffee and I'm going to read Simon and the Homo Sapiens Agenda before we see the movie today. So let's get this day started. to go see Simon and a Homo Sapiens Agenda. So we are excited. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> hey, movie time! Movie time! <laughs> Shannon says she got the candy. She got the and candy. the pop. <laughs> and the pop. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Go see Simon. We just saw Love Simon. Mm -hmm. What did you think? I loved it. Oh, Jennifer Garner was awesome too. Very heartwarming. Oh, it was beautiful. If you're looking for a good movie that will be heartwarming and just beautiful and everything you want it to be as far as LGBTQ, kindness, showing love, you should see it. Yes, definitely. And, and uh, it seems to be a lot like the book mm -hmm. in a lot of ways. So, But we won't spoil the movie just to say if you haven't read the book, you should read the book and go see the movie. Mm -hmm. Love, Simon. Check it out, guys. Yeah, check it out. And we'll see you in our next vlog in a few. Bye. Hi, everyone. I'm Melanie. I'm Shannon. The, our channel, The Book Chronicles. And today we have a book haul that we wanted to do. Yesterday we saw Simon and the Homo Sapiens Agenda. The vlog previous to this is going to show you our experience there. Right now we're going to get into our book haul and just show you some books that we got at Barnes and Nobles. Now some of these are divided between two hauls. We didn't get these all at once. A lot of them we did. Just a, a mix of what we both picked out. But this is one of the authors that we met at CFF and we didn't get a chance to get her book that night. We loved her so much. She was just so nice. And I wanted to get into a mermaid story. I've never read a mermaid story. I am in the middle of this. I, I have stopped though for just for a moment while I'm, I'm buddy reading Children of Blood and Bone with Melissa and Liko. This is the Mer Chronicles and the first book is called Emerge. The second book is called Submerge. This is really good so far. I'm really liking it. Very mystical. We did get autographed copies because she did sign some books while she was there. She signed Believe in Your Magic, Toby Easton. And then this one she signed Dive Deeper. I think this is a good series. I have a feeling it's going to be a great series. I, I'm only a few pages into the first book, 86 pages. I'm really liking it so far. This is a series that was recommended to me from Melissa and Liko, but I decided I want to try the Daughter of the Pirate King series, so I got both books, Daughter of the Siren Queen and Daughter of the Pirate King. So I'm really excited to get into those. And then I was really intrigued by this. It's called Through the Looking Glass Wars. And I'm really big Alice in Wonderland fan. And I think this is a, it says fantasy just declared war on reality. Hoping it's very good. I don't know a whole lot about it. I think it's a retelling of the Through the Looking Glass. 
And the next one, me and Melanie are really excited about. It's gonna mean a lot to me because like I said, I just lost my mother not to suicide. It still deals with grief. I've been wanting to read a lot of, of healing books on grief. This one is called The Astonishing Color of After by Emily R. X. R. Pan. It's her debut novel. It's about a girl that her mother commits suicide and she sees her mother as a bird. So very excited to read this. Obviously a trigger warning for suicide though. So hopefully this will be a pretty good book. Two next two picks for me was Winter Song. I believe this is a Beauty and the Beach retelling. I'm not sure, but I really love the cover and I'm really excited to get into this. The next one, last one for me is called Girls Made of Snow and Glass. And again, this is another retelling, I think, of Snow White. I'm not sure. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. I did manage to pick up another bullet journal. Now one in my one of my favorite colors, purple. We've been kind of on a mermaid kick. Yes. <laughs> I've been fascinated with mermaids because me they're too. gender fluid. And ever since uh, Jazz from I Am Jazz. They're very mythical. Interesting creatures. Transgender women. They, they love the, the mermaids a lot because they are gender fluid. And I tend to like the mermaids a lot because they are gender fluid. The first book that I have... I'm very interested in reading because I love The Little Mermaid, the original Disney classic. And we'll do a whole mermaid theme thing. Yeah. And we'll do some reviews on books and maybe do a surprise outing to a nice restaurant. I picked up a dark retelling of The Little Mermaid called To Kill a Kingdom. And it's probably Ursula's a Revenge. I don't know much about it except that it's a dark it's got retelling. Got a nice of cover. Yes, I like it. And then you see the octopus tentacles and all that. The second book that I have it's is... the first in the series, it's book one. It's a series book, yes. And it is by Jennifer Donnelly. And it's called Deep Blue. Then I picked up... That would be the second book. Rogue Wave. Then the Dark third book. Mm -hmm. Dark Tide. Awesome covers. Uh, yes, I love the covers. And we'll also do some good movie suggestions for mermaids, if you like mermaids. And then the fourth book, Sea Spell, and they're all by Jennifer Donnelly. I'm looking forward to reading this because I'm very interested in mermaids and the mythical creature. How they develop and how each author develops the character of the mermaid. And you see them throughout time, you see different interpretations on what the mermaids look like and how mythical they are. And we're on a high from watching Love, Simon. We'll give you a full review. You'll, you'll see a full review of that, the vlog video that we'll do before this video. We hope that you have enjoyed our book haul. And until next time, I'm Melanie. I'm Shannon. And we wish you peace, love, books, and coffee. And many blessings.